Hello everybody and welcome back to another Schlib on Switch unboxing video. Today we have a package from NAS America and it is Ease 10 Nordics. Now in here we have the sling bag that's part of the official collector edition. Not an extra item and we have the actual game with the collector edition here. Let's get rid of the box. And here so we have the two items. This all was sold as a bundle. It wasn't able to purchase this extra now it's actually funny because i already have a bag i actually purchased this bag used from japan um before the english version of this game was even announced then when i saw that it was going to be included in the english collector edition i just had a good laugh out of it so i'm not actually going to open this one it's nice and compactly sealed so i am just going to leave this one sealed but yeah it looks pretty much the same has the Falcom tag, the NA, uh, the East 10 Nordics patch, same color for the zipper. Over here, the inner, the smaller pocket, the same color for the bigger pocket. We've got the pouch, and we have the back of the two bags. Not sure if I did that on camera properly. I wasn't paying attention, but yeah. So here we have the really cool sling bag. I actually used this. I got it right before I went on an international trip. Um, almost a year uh, no actually actually it was back in March um, so about half a year ago and I actually love this <laughs> had like my switch my passport my wallet you know my earbuds and just walking around the airport and the plane this was great just having this all in a nice bag my battery pack also I really enjoyed using it for that trip I'm definitely gonna use it again whenever I travel next so it's really really cool item to have with it and yeah so that's the bag and now we have the actual collector edition so East 10 Nordics is the 10th game in the East series, or the 11th game in the East series, um, but the 10th game to come out in English um, because we never got East 5, and yeah, so East 10. Um, I did not play a lot of the East games. I've the, Actually, the first Falcom game I played, because I love Falcom, was actually East 8, Lacrimosa of Donna, but I didn't get too far into it. Actually, that's not true because I once played East one on the mobile and really <laughs> played only for a few minutes but yeah um so the first one i played on switch was lacrimosa of donna which i never finished i need to go back to it um after i finished my kaseki playthrough i'm like i have to play ease now so i played ease origins um ease book one and two on the psp and ease origin on the switch and i never continued the my series playthrough of that it's been a while i've always been on my mind like i need to get back to it and I never have. And now we have Ease 10 coming at, came out. And I was like, I wasn't going to play it right away. And then I started the demo when it came out. And holy schnitzels, I love the demo. Absolutely gripped me and hooked me in. And now the game is here. I finished the demo um, just before release. But obviously I didn't actually get this on release. And now I finally get to play it for myself. So here we have the artwork for the front. We have that side, and we have the other side, and we have the artwork on the back. Let's pop this open. And we got the inside here. If you're interested in this game and you want to try out the demo, um, definitely give it a go. It is a really, really long demo. You got to play the entire prologue, the entire chapter one, the entire chapter two, and most of chapter three. Um, I was looking at a walkthrough, and I was surprised by how close to the ch end of Chapter 3 I got. So yeah, we pull out all the items from the inside of this package. And there's nothing else in there. So here we have the actual game, which we'll look at in a minute. Then we have the Ease 10 Nordics original mini soundtrack, with some nice artwork on the front. And we get the picture, this picture here on the back, with six tr eight tracks on this soundtrack. Let's get this plastic off. Um, the Ease games, if you never played the series, they're all um, set in the same universe, the same main. Most of them, besides for Ease, Ease Origin, has the main character of Adol, but the games are all mostly standalone. You know, there are references between games, but they can be played in any, any order with little knowledge of the rest. But here we have the Ease 10 disc soundtrack. 
and we have the back with this awesome artwork. Ooh, I freaking love this artwork, actually. This is an incredible, incredible piece of art from an awesome moment in the first chapter. So that's really cool. I love that. Then we have a series of art cards. Let's pull this out. So we have this first card here. With a bunch of our child characters hanging out in their clubhouse. We have this one here, which I'm not sure which moment of the game this is yet, but that's also similar to the artwork on the front. We have Karja and the Pirates. We have Adol, Dogi, and the Doctor Flare. Just checking out some landscapes. We have Adol on Karja looking at that stone. I forgot the exact terminology there. And some more artwork of them as well. So yeah, a nice little set of postcards that probably no one will ever use to mail to anyone. <laughs> but it's definitely cute. Then we have this metal pin over here with the logo of the game. Comes in a nice housing box over here. And last but not least is we have the East 10 Nordics Book of Har. We got the art book. Table of contents, warning, this contains spoilers. So I'm just going to flip through it like I usually do with art books quickly. We have the introduction, some characters, enemies, artwork. Pretty light for an art book, but still cool nonetheless. I always lo I love the binding on them. And now let's check out the actual game. So we have the deluxe edition with the artwork on the front here. We saw the same art on one of the postcards. Front, spine, and the back. Two heroes, one thrilling adventure, a boundless sea of discovery. Experience the perils of the Obelia Gulf through the eyes of Adol Kristen and his unexpected ally, the pirate Karja Balta. This deluxe edition includes a digital soundtrack and a mini art book. And we got the art and screenshots, and we have the info here. Inside, we're going to open this up off camera. <laughs> so we have our artwork here, which we've already seen that artwork. We have a warranty. We have, let's just make sure I do this off camera properly. We have our digital soundtrack and the track list here, which is on, which is the same as the CD. All music by Falcom Sound Team JDK, which always puts out some bangers tracks. And we have the art book here, a little mini art book. So yeah, Ease 10 Nordics is also the first game by Falcom to be de developed with the Switch in mind. So if you played Ease 8 and Ease 9 and have had some issues on the Switch, this, this one was developed with Switch in mind. Obviously, other systems are going to be better. That's never a doubt. But the Switch version runs amazing. I had a great time with the demo. The graphics and the frame rate and everything, the smoothness, it was just awesome. Really, really, really ran great on the Switch and really makes me excited for the next Switch-developed game which is going to be obviously Trails in the Sky the first. So let's put Trails through Daybreak on the side again, because I'm slowly making my way through that as a replay. Um, and we pop it in. So we got the icon, the same as the demo. We have version 1.00 on the cartridge. And there is an update, which was expected. And let's check for points. And we get 60 points for this release. So yeah, I'm going to go continue playing this. Not right now because I got stuff to do, but I cannot wait to dive back into this game and get to fight that boss that left me on a nice cliffhanger for that demo. So yeah, East 10 Nordics. Are you playing this game? What is your favorite game in the East series if you played the others? And are you getting this? Which version of this did you get? As always, if you like this video, like, comment, subscribe, share with your friends, ring the bell for notifications on future videos, and have a great day. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.